Hey everybody, my name's Silver, welcome back to the channel, and today guys, we got the first video in a very, very long time. It's a Kurtz Pell video, and I just realized how off that is and how much it's going to drive me nuts unless I fix it. There we go. So guys, we are back to discuss the new Karma in Kurtz Pell. Um, so not much is known about it, it was just revealed like today what it is um it's like a hammer with wings so this is the symbol for it and i've been theorizing since i watched the trailer early this morning but i had school and some other things i had to take care of first so i've been watching i've been looking at this karma all day i watched the trailers a couple times and these are the three screenshots i took from it because i thought they were the most important so let's start off with the symbol it's a hammer with wings and we will see that later on that's very important i do think this is going to be the new breaker class so if you guys don't know what karmas are in Kurtzpel, Kurtzpel is an anime MMO game where you get to choose from a different bunch of different weapons and items, and that allows you to play differently. With uh, when I said breaker just a minute, just a second ago, breaker is one of the class one of the classifications for karmas. One of the two types you have breaker and slayer. Breakers are sort of these heavy hitting attacks that open up your opponent for um damage so in to my knowledge there's only two breakers currently in the game out of the five karmas which would be the giant sword and the fist the other three classifications are bow staff and uh dual swords which are katana like so i see this being like a very fast paced breaker or maybe even mid range uh breaker so it's not going to be as slow as necessarily as the great sword but it probably wouldn't be as fast as the fist. So in our in the next image I got, oh that's wrong, would be uh, this one. So as you saw here, we'll just discuss her name. So she, this is all coming out in like 15-ish days, 16-ish days is Lime, Sacred Guardian. So she also has wings, which gives me, I think this class will have probably some sort of like high movement speed. And this is the full version of her and my God, does she look friggin adorable um so she has two wings surrounded by feathers and as you can see right here is where i was referring to the uh wings on the like hammer they're or they're represented with wings i guess they're not physical wings like this i feel like this will be this class is gonna have some really good things going for it um i it's a hammer class so it's gonna do a lot of smashing but i think that you might even be able to throw this hammer uh, my theory on that is because of this cloth she's holding right here that I don't see any real reason why other for that besides to maybe throw it and then yank it back. But that could also just be very well flimsy in my dream of always wanting weapons that you can throw and yank back. But I do think this is a really cool classification. I love the lighting and the design of it. And guys, oh, I cannot wait for this update to play Kurt's Pell. I've been playing a lot of Borderlands 3, so it'll be nice to throw something else into my gaming schedule with friends and stuff. But yeah, I think this is a pretty cool classification that's coming out. Um, I haven't seen a name on this class yet. Well, besides the Guardian, which I think might be a proper name. Uh, the Sacred Guardian could be the class name. But uh, yeah, let me know what you guys know down in the comments below. Theories and all that stuff. And honestly, guys, please subscribe if you enjoyed, leave a like if you did enjoy the content, and leave a dislike if you didn't, because I want to know either way. And thank you, guys. I know this was a short video. I'm just recovering from being sick and allergies back to back. So, um, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll talk to you all later. Peace, and bye for now.